I feel like the one piece of advice that I always give to everybody, and this goes for honestly, like sexuality or literally anything in life is like, you get to choose your own path. Yep. Like it may not seem like it and it might not be an easy, an easy path to choose in any way, shape or form. So I don't want to act like it will be, but like, you know, I always say like family is not defined by blood. Like I love my family and I'm very grateful to be, you know, have an amazing family around me. But like, had I, you know, not had that situation, like I'm a firm believer in like finding people that would take a bullet for you and that would love you as their own family. Yep. Like when I was 17, I moved out to LA alone because my parents were still in New York and had my little brother there. But I got really close with my best friend, Laura. Who signed your, uh, who signed your lease agreement? Or, my or? best friend, Laura's mom is what I'm, and I'm about to talk to that, uh, into uh, that right now. Okay, okay. So I, um, I met my best friend, Laura and her family, they live down in, um, like, East LA. Yep. Um, I lived with them on and off for six months and their family took me in. Uh, Laura's parents didn't even really speak much English. And like, I really worked with them to help them out a lot. I mean, they spoke English, but like I worked with yeah. them to like yeah. help them and like, and like teach them more about just like influencers and like artistry and stuff. And um, like they have a clothing boutique. So like I worked with Laura really closely as well on bringing a lot of other influencers into the brand and stuff and like getting people to use coupon codes and to promote it. And like, still after almost six years now, we're like, we're still best friends and we still see each other at least twice a week. And Very I still see cool. their family every day. Um, and like Laura's mom became like a mother figure to me. So I'm a firm believer in like, no matter what situation you're in, yep. you know, it's up to you to, you know, choose your own path, choose your own job, you know, go to college or not go to college, be surrounded by who you want to be surrounded with. Yep. Um, there's just been so many situations where like people, you know, I'm un like, I talk to people that are like, you know, I'm just like stuck or like, oh, I can't do this because my parents said no, but I'm like, oh, you're 20 years old and your, your parents are saying no, like that sounds a little bit weird or yep. like just like situations, you know, or like guys that'll be like, oh, I like, I'm in love with you, but like, I can never come out to my family. Like they're homophobic. And I'm like, well, like, are, okay, but like you're gay. So like. Mm. totally get that and totally understand like not wanting to lose that relationship with your family. But like, why would you, I just can't imagine wanting to hide who I truly am for people that like are, wouldn't like me for it. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, but once again, like I was never raised that way. I was never in that type of situation. So it's hard for me to imagine that. And I'm sure it's obviously really, really challenging when you are in that position yeah, yeah. a million percent. So I don't want to invalidate anybody's course, fear position at yeah, all yeah, or yeah, fear. Sure, Cause it, sure. like I said, it's probably very, very scary and it's probably not easy for a lot of people. But like at the end of the day, it is your decision to make what, like, if you want to stay with, you know, that particular family or that particular person or make a specific Especially decision. now, I mean, it's, it's 2020. We have access to so many things at the tip yeah. of our fingers, whether it's through a phone or even like <clears throat> when I was young, there was no such thing as Uber. Right. Now, now it's Uber, bro. A 13 year old. I got to your house on my longboard, Mac. Oh my God. Now, now yeah. imagine, imagine I'm 12 years old. I can order this thing called Uber on my mom's credit card. And I'm there in five minutes and I'll have to sweat through the summer in Ohio. Mm -hmm. Like it is, it is, we are approaching uh, an age where you can do and be anything you want. Yeah. And, and, and absolutely. Creators and I've always had like that mindset are, too, yeah. but not, not everybody does. I think it's kind of goes full circle to what we were talking about earlier. Like it really is a mindset. Like if you want to get out of a situation, it might not be easy. It might not be easy in any way, shape or form, but you know, it's the best you, thing you can, you can, you. Yeah. You can. it always is possible.